Happy 2024. This is the first video of the new year in my series of videos called Life in Retrospect and View. Um, what is this Life in Retrospect and View thing? Well, um, I've sort of challenged myself uh, to communicate what it's like uh, to run a small company, to run a small coffee roastery, on the basis that there might be some folk out there on the internet that has uh, or finds some value in me discussing these things. Uh, it's also a way of me being able to keep myself honest, to review the things that I have succeeded or failed with during the week, and in view to be able to then look forward to rectifying the things that I got wrong or iterate on the things that I did well. Um, anyway, first week back, short week, Tuesday through fr Friday. Today is Friday the 5th of January. Um, it has been an immensely busy week for reasons that uh, you may be aware of by now, we're installing a new coffee roaster. Uh, we have waited a long time for this to happen. Um, I committed to purchase the new roaster in March 2022 and because of the debacle that was COVID um, it took 18 months for the thing to arrive. Anyway here we are now we're day four of the installation process. Our installer Malcolm Qualeri uh, is on his penultimate day today. There is some a little bit of an internal works to do with the flu erection uh, and then hopefully post lunch we should be able to do the first fire up. Um, anyway, I'll talk about that in greater depth at some other time. Uh, how's the week been? Um, FYI, to anybody who's thinking about doing big projects, don't do it in the first week back of January. It was the stupidest thing to arrange. I mean, not just because you're coming off a period of break where you're relaxed and not necessarily dialed into the standard functions of work, um, but there's a lot of, you know, chatting with your work pals about what happened over Christmas. So you may be a little relaxed. I came in to work at 100 mile an hour and I kind of wish that I didn't. Anyway, Tuesday was roasting and the first day with Malcolm on site. Uh, roasting was tough, uh, not just because I had to manage all the other facets of the business, uh, but also it was raining all day and raining on the probat uh, can be a little tough. Um, just everything wasn't, nothing worked well on Tuesday. Um, Wednesday was then a day, uh, again, more, um, more installation work on, on the lorring, uh, but it was a good day on the dials for me. I, I roasted good coffee, it went well. I exceeded the roast um, uh, production volume that I wanted. So what, what I mean by that is I've now got a little headroom going into next week uh, because Monday in view, I've got to have a whole day off production roasting in order to do some training on the, on the new machine. Uh, so that was good. Wednesday was good. Thursday, yesterday, tough day. Um, I was in Oxfordshire. Uh, extracting some equipment um, from a company, uh, which meant a 4 a.m. start uh, to be able to be in and out and back into Hull by midday um, in order for me to continue with the standard Thursday commitments that I have. Um, however, here we are now, it's Friday. I've had a good night's sleep last night. I feel refreshed. I'm doing one of these videos, um, which, I hope have improved a little since I first started, maybe not necessarily in the decor or ambience, i.e. the damn studio that I haven't yet done, uh, but maybe I'm a touch more comfortable in front of the camera, um, which is probably a better viewing experience for you guys. Anyway, uh, that was the week in retrospect. Uh, I think it's all been pretty good. Um, the, the week in view is gonna be better. Um, we have training on the Monday. I have production roasting Tuesday and Wednesday. There might be a little bit of Thursday spillover. And then hopefully we get them back into the standard cadence of the business. Everybody likes some sort of structure in their week. 
I enjoy structure as a human. Um, from structure will allow us the space then to start hitting on the big projects that we've got for the coming year. Number one being the transition from the probat onto the lorrying. I've got a lot of R&D to do with that. For that, I have to do quite a lot of delegation of some of the tasks and roles that I, I perform within the business. Um, so we've got to get going on that. Otherwise, I'll fall behind on the roasting. Uh, and we should have a good thing to do, a good project in the summertime. We're 15 years old this summer, so let's do something about that. And we've also got an eye on uh, an interesting thing come autumn stroke, uh, early early uh, winter. Um, so what's that, October, November time this year. So we've got to get those things into place and plan. Uh, so hopefully we'll do, be able to do that next week. Anyway, um, I've released a new coffee this week. I've done a video on that, go and watch that. It's delightful. And that's the week in retrospect and view. I'll see you again next time.